I'm here today with a classroom session to do a code of conduct. We've been going around the Potoba Primary Schools to ensure that the schools are abiding by a certain code of conduct so that when they do play in the Tata Steel Wizards League that they can abide to a certain set of rules. Okay, what we say in rugby, okay, negativity, okay, is contagious, okay, it's like a disease. So if you're negative and you pass negative vibes to other people, it will catch on, okay, other people will start being negative too. So we need to be positive and making sure that we are always trying to be nice, friendly and engaging with people in the correct way to make sure that we are all being happy, yeah, happy play. be educated really on the importance of sport first and foremost but understanding the values of sport and how to behave during sport dealing with winning and losing etc how to be uh, a good loser a gracious loser etc and how to be a gracious winner as well so trying to pull all that together to in, in a code, code of conduct is, is very very important the children have input into what they expect from themselves and uh, the teachers have input into what we expect as, as teachers within the school and I think it's important that that is mirrored when they leave the school and take part in rugby, netball, whatever sort of sport in fixtures that there needs to be a code of conduct which they follow because ultimately they represent in the school in these fixtures that they're taking part in. We're also privileged and excited to be partnering with the Ospreys in the community Therefore, what they'll be doing is running some physical activity sessions within the schools after the classroom session, the code of conduct session, and it's just an exciting prospect actually that the region and a club like Aberavon can and form a partnership. We've linked up with Aberavon RFC in the community because we share the same values. Um, we're looking to drive powerful messages forward such as healthy lifestyles, uh, inclusion, sport and education and that's something that we feel special um, and, and proud to be a part of within this Otolbert area.